Hey ladies and gentlemen, Elon Musk is making people angry again. <laughs> Shall Twitter offer general amnesty to suspended accounts providing that they have not broken the law or engaged in egregious spam? A lot of people were like, yeah, we need to do that. Life has to be equal, right? So the next tweet, within 24 hours, the people have spoken. Amnesty begins next week. Vox Populi, Vox Dei. Vox Populi is a Latin phrase that literally means voice of the people. It is used in English in meaning the opinion of the majority of the people. It kind of makes sense, right? But wait, there's more. So Rams Paul, Twitter is reportedly nuking Chupacabra accounts. This is eliminating much of Antifa Twitter. And Elon responded like a boss. Removing child exploitation is priority number one. Please reply in comments if you see anything that Twitter needs to address, which is a beautiful thing. And then Andy goes by. <laughs> Hello, everyone. How are you? Fine, thank you. Andy now is coming there, our best gay friend. A larger number of Antifa accounts operate on Twitter to promote riots, give tips on how to commit violent crimes and post names, photo, addresses of targets plus their family members. Yeah. Oh my god! And Andy now immediately fact checks with gangster stuff like Portland far left militant who repeatedly had his felony as an Antifa riot cases drum has now been charged following a child sex thing targeting online. Uh, uh, uh. What's happening? It keeps happening in left wing majorities. No, <laughs> and I love it when people come by list of convicted Republicans who who chupacabras. I'm like. What's the point? It's both bad. Left and right. Did I? No, yeah, I did it right. <laughs> but the point is, why are they sometimes so intelligent? They seem even stupid. And they always come with pictures like Republicans. Look what you're doing with the girls. I don't agree with that. You label me right wing. I'm not right wing, I just care more about my own kid, but you decide that you can decide what I want for my kids, as if this is normal to justify this. Remember what the little boy posed with a naked man and they said, drag isn't sexual. They can't try to gaslight, but they defended this and other little boys stripping for adult men, calling it custom chin. This is grooming. And the right wing's like, yes, I love how they molest the little kids like that. Go get them, Boy Scouts. Go get them, priests. Please vote for our molesters and our pedophiles, Republicans say. Republicans, you're guilty, okay? And I'll tell you right now, the number one reason they constantly talk about pedophilia is because it's going through their heads. Non-stop they're thinking about kids, I guarantee it. The reason Tim Pool wears a beanie is because he's trying to contain the pedophilia that's in his head. That's why he's always talking about it. He's seeing it everywhere. Why? Because he's projecting. Shut the front door. I don't want the left version. I don't want the right version. Anybody that wants to make a girl or a boy feel in a specific way so beautiful by getting attention from other people, I consider it bad for their mental health. Just like I think it's bad to give a little person a phone to get him distracted because I don't want to waste my time helping him with that. He can explore life because I need to keep him safe playing in the corner with the phone. Everybody have a specific opinion but when you come and tell me the people they want to diddle little kids right they can't control themselves we need to help them understand maybe they have trauma I'm like maybe we need to prevent the trauma and those with the trauma we need to help them in a better way not by suggesting you know what if we have videos of old people we arrested maybe we can give them those videos so they can watch it like prawn I've heard that stupid suggestion and you're gonna be like, why would you even consider the most stupid suggestion? Because all the suggestions that were stupid from the 80s to the 90s to the 2000s, oh, pull it up, Jamie. They all have been suggested and I thought it was stupid and the slippery slope keeps on happening. So I'm freaking happy that everybody gets on ban, all these kid diddlers get removed, and now we can have two gangster opinions and we can have an equal, normal, middle center people. You know why? Because I hate the fact that I keep silencing the people on the right and say, oh my God, I don't have any freaking opinion. I guess I am right. 
You don't even battle the people on the center. You battle the people from the right, but they don't exist. Now the center is the new right. Damn, you might even make some left-leaning people that's not even far left center. And you attack the center. You're always attacking. I'm happy Elon Musk is doing this. Maybe he's not the best person, but if we don't have a center, a balance in our lives, I don't want to share your world in my world, especially with my kid. Make your own. I know that pisses you off sometimes because you can't. Well, then adopt. And then you're going to tell me, why don't you adopt? I've already made one. And then you re And those that agree might like the video. <laughs> Peace.